my boiler, Baxi Luna Height 380, tells me an E130. I looked at the exhaust, everything is fine, I did many resets, same problem. Anything I can do slash check before I call a technician? I'm technical, so feel free to write with details. Hi, my name is have been in the plumbing and heating trade for approximately 15 years. I will be helping you today. Check the air pressure switch tubes are clear and undamaged first. E130 flue gas temperature sensor slash air pressure switch ensure the venting is within the maximum venting length requirements check for obstructions in the venting and termination make sure there is water in the condensate trap check gas pressure on the inlet test port of the gas valve and make certain there is less than 14 inches width.c. Reset boiler and analyze the combustion gas to ensure the correct CO2 and CO values and G high fire is 8.7% CO2 and 50 to 60 parts per million CO. NG low fire is 8.4% CO2 and 0 to 7 parts per million CO LP high fire is 10% CO2 and 70 to 80 parts per million CO. LP low fire is 9.8% CO2 and 10 to 15 parts per million CO when CO levels are significantly higher than the value stated above, the boiler is recycling products of combustion. Ensure all flu and air intake connection gasket seals are positone correctly. Note, the flu high limit has a red, manual reset button in the center of the sensor. Check that line 608 and 611 have been adjusted according to the proper gas type check that the proper CA 73 parameter values have been set with respect to venting length and altitude. These values can be found in the installation manual, ensure that there are no loose wires, sound connections, and that the pressure switch is opening and closing properly check the silicone tubes coming from the air pressure switch for kinks, melting and holes, make sure that the low pressure opening at the back of the unit is not blocked. If an E130 error code persists, jump the flue gas sensor. If the boiler fires change the high limit. If the problem persists change the main control board. Hi Brian, I already checked vented, I even put the shop back in to make sure there is no obstruction, nothing came out. The pipe is something like 3 feet long, horizontal for the most part of it, it has a 90 degree elbow at the boiler, this is an existing installation and it's used to work well, for 5 years, just last weekend it started to show that error code and does not product hot water. As soon as I reset, it shows me the temp, I guess, for a one second and then shows the E130 error code. The answer is more for a technician, I don't have anything to analyze gas pressure. I haven't opened the boiler to look inside. If I remove the panel, is there anything I can look at? You need to check the air pressure switch tubes are clear and undamaged. They are only plastic and can kink also check the condensate trap is clean free flowing and that the trap still has water in it if all these are okay you will need to call in an engineer. Sorry best regards Brian. Could you tell me how the air pressure switch look look? Also how can I find the condensate trap? Am I supposed to flush the tank on a regular basis? Could it be the problem? HTTP colon slash www.parts4heating.com slash v slash file slash exploded view slash Baxi Luna 33380 Click on part number 23 for fan switch and part number 415 for condensate trap. Siphon best regards, Brian. Brian, the unit is at the cottage, which I plan to go next weekend. Then I'll be able to do what you suggest. Quick question, how do I gain access to the inside of unit? By removing the two screws at the bottom panel. I would think so although I work on so many different types I couldn't really tell you offhand. It's normally very obvious how to remove the fronts. 
If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.